Hey everybody, Lou with Bergen Pickers here. Today we're going to check out one of my all-time favorite toy lines. It's Mask by Kenner Toys, the originator of the Star Wars toys and action figures. We'll take a look at the box, we'll go over the instruction manual, look at the figure, and then eventually transform the vehicle and revert it back to what it was originally, back to the street bike. So it goes from street bike to hovercraft. I'm just going to show you the box here a little bit. Um, this was one of my favorite toy lines, period. Uh, so shout out to all the 80s kids who experienced this and had the pleasure of playing with these toys because, you know, they would offer so much. You could transform the uh, vehicle and, you know, have these figures and it came with a large playset, which, I th what was it called? It was Boulder Hill. Boulder Hill, that was a large playset. Okay, so that's the box. We'll just put that over there. We're going to look at Ali Bombay, who was the character that came with this toy and his mask. There we go, we had it backwards there. And we'll just put that on him. Set him to the side. Hopefully he'll stand. There you go. This is the uh, booklet that came with it. And it would show you exactly how it transforms. So, this toy sold for $75 because it is complete in box. I mean, it is complete complete and everything is functional on it i'll have a slideshow of all the photos uh, that we took of the toy at the end of this video so i'll put a timestamp in the description and you can just skip to that if you'd like okay so put the instruction manual there and here's the vehicle and it has a little kickstand here set it up have it just sit right there okay I'm gonna flip that back carefully and this is the button that triggers the mechanism which turns the bike into a hovercraft okay show you from the bottom here all right and this is a hook right here which in the instruction manual and the box it basically hooks onto one of the character's legs, and I guess you can drag him along, that's how you capture him. And this is how you bring it back. It's got like a little wheel right here. Use your thumb and forefinger to just kind of retract it back. I noticed that um, these toe hooks and, and hooks were pretty popular in the 1980s because one of the characters, I think it was Spidor from uh, the Masters of the Universe toy line, had a similar feature to it. And then also in the front, it's got like a cannon or like a laser that um, you use this little lever button here to to pull out. And and that's essentially it. Um, this is how you transform it back. You just make sure the wheels align, which is quite easy to do. Toy line. Well, this particular toy came on in uh, 1987. Really neat. They were fairly inexpensive for the time. And they had, a, again, like a, a, a varied amount of vehicles and characters. You can even buy the figures in two packs. And I'm, I'm going to cover that as I'll continue making more videos with uh, mask toys. So if you're interested in more mask toys, there's, there's going to be multiple videos coming up within the next uh, couple of weeks. And, uh, and I'll cover a whole bunch of them and how to transform, etc. Just like this one. Alright, well, thank you very much for tuning in. And I'll catch you guys next time.